the National Assessment of Educational Progress, the NAEP, which is called America's Report Card, reports that two-thirds, get this, two-thirds of American eighth graders are not proficient in any core subject. There's a standardized international assessment called PISA, the Program for International Student Assessment. It's administered to 15-year-olds around the world, and since it was first administered in the year 2000, American students' ranking has been steadily declining. Right now, our students, 15-year-old students, are ranked 24th in the world in reading comprehension behind such countries as Estonia and New Zealand. Our students are 25th in the world in their knowledge of science behind Slovenia and Vietnam. And our students are 40th in the world in their understanding of mathematics behind Russia and Malta. Now, compare that to when the United States finishes fourth in the Winter Olympics, the American people are incensed. But we're 40th in the world in math mathematics, and what happens? Well, here's what happens. Affluent families enroll their children in private schools. Middle-income families move to the suburbs in the highly ranked school districts. And America's forgotten students languish in failing and underperforming schools with no power to do anything about it. 